Hi YouTube. Today I have nothing special, but little work and save your money. You see this girl here? It got hit. I think. Well, according to what he says, uh, there's derby on the road, and somebody hit it and knocking down this grill right here. This is the grill that like this knocking this piece broken and um, I will try to fix this grill because the chrome here is still there and the chrome here is still here so I'm going to replace the plastic piece right here but I had to take the whole molding out to get uh, to put the new ones in there's a couple clip that is on the top here that you have to uh, take them out you can use a screwdriver, a flat screwdriver, to take this clip like this out. Or you have a trim ply. Trim ply will work pretty good. Or you don't have one. If you have a ring ply like this, you can use a ring ply to pry it out. Okay. So I'm going to take this out. Or you have a something like this. Or even something like this. That works too. You can get this from Harbor, like a dollar or something, cheap, okay? Don't spend a lot of money for something that you only use one time. And that's basically you want to save some money besides taking to a professional doing for you. If you have a question how to do it, after you're watching my video, you don't understand, don't forget to help me subscribe and ask me a question so i can answer your question for you okay the first one came out you put on top right here take this one out okay another one right here it's a trim ply okay put that all the way i recommend it to take the 10 millimeter right here out I'll take this screws out and you need to take this clip right here out too. There's a screw right here underneath right there. Okay, take this screws out and pop this bumper out. Okay, okay inside here there's a clip holding this. So you have to use a screwdriver or anything like this to open the clip so you can pop the clips out okay don't break this clip if you break this clip it won't hold your bumper okay there's another see the reason you have to take this bumper out because this screw right here you have to uh, take him out if you can take the headlights out, then you don't have to take this bumper. But easiest way, just take the bumper out. So and you just go do the other side, same thing in this side over here. You can check your car's arc, or you don't have to, just take this the hole in the bottom here. Like one clip the holding right here so that right there this one and i think this one also have a clip holding it okay take all of this clip out to get this bumper out of the way it's an easier to way to work on that So soon you're taking down the bo bottom clip and the bumper just dropping like that. Okay. And then you can work on the clip. So this clip right here holding it. Okay. What you have to do is just open this clip and push the grill out. Okay. Slowly pry it out by one there's so many of this little shoppy like this or you can use a flat screwdriver 
whatever you have you can push this little clip out okay like that I use my elbow to push the bumper and my hand pull the uh, grill out that's the only way that I can held them right here something that you worry you worry about the bumper okay because the grill is a waste grill normal okay this I'll pop this side open see it right here There, now it came out. Okay, on this Honda, you have this screw right here holding it. Little piece of grill have a screw down here, too. So you have to take this one out to put on the new one. If, if you are broken, then you assembly everything. But on this, it's not broke, so I just ordered the one. The piece that broke only. Okay, so only two screw holding it, and do the same thing. Just pry this out and push, push this uh, clip, and pull the uh, chrome grills out. <coughs> I will do it from the side, and both sides have. On the end, they, they, they have a, this little screw here too. So make sure you take this screw out before you push. Because if you don't take this out, you may break that. Okay. Okay. So many clips. Okay. Okay, pop this open. Put the one right here open. So the one on mine, I don't have to be careful because um, I don't need the black piece already. I just, I can snap it out, but I just do the right way so when you follow me, you will follow exactly what I didn't break, you know? So you use your finger to the back like holding down like this so you can push the pin out easier, okay? So same thing the bottom grill, you have a four screw or six screw holding this bottom grill also. Okay. So take all this screw out. And then the last one will be this right here in the corner. So when you do it, you should know already, but in case you don't see it okay and don't forget to take this clip here out too because this clip is holding it okay so now take the clip out and ready to take the chrome so on my clip is I don't really need this clip no more so I could just break this Okay, on your, if you, if you don't break, then be careful, don't break this clip, okay. When you break this clip, your grill won't hold together. Don't break the chrome, okay. You want to break the black plastic one. Okay, so now I can push out my chrome grill. Got my chrome. Just throw the black one out. And ready to put the new ones in. Okay. So when you on new one, just be careful. 
Okay. Okay. So just push in, it will lock by itself. Okay. So now just put the screw back on. So when you put it back on, it's easy. You don't have to wash me no more. I got both side um, chrome put it in. So now just lie, lay it back here and just snap this in. That's all. Pretty simple. Uh, when you put it back, um, just lay it toward the clip and then just push the clip, lock it in, and that, that's all you have to do. Okay? And uh, you may not have to watch this video no more because the hardest part is take them out. But this part right here is easy. Slide in. Make sure you lock it into the clip. That's all. Okay? Alright. So for in case your clip does not slide in to lock it in, I will use this a quarter extension to put right here and tap it until it's locking. That's all I do, okay? I didn't show in your video, but slowly tap, don't break it. You know, you don't have to be hammer all the way. It just slowly tap, it should be able to lock already, okay? So now it's done, let me put it back into the bumper clip. Slowly slide in, okay? Because so many clips they have to be snapped in. And you hear a clip? Okay. Same thing. Put it in, it's easy. Okay, right here. Make sure you push all the way up and go inside that little clip first before you push in. Otherwise, you will break that clip. Okay, easy. So just put the screw, that's it. So you finish the rest and uh, you know on, on this small job like this at the shop they probably charge you a lot of money because they have to take the bumper down okay but anything small like this you can do yourself uh, just take your time take all the clip out and you should be able to do it fine all right thank you for watching please help me subscribe okay bye bye now